what we're seeing there is actually Lisa Carr looking mm -hmm. through the photos and speaking in the background. She currently lives mm -hmm. in the tri-state but has deep roots along the coast that was obviously pummeled by Michael. Nine on your sides, Paula Suro spoke with her about what it's like to lose a little bit of home. As Hurricane Michael swept through the Florida panhandle, destroying homes and neighborhoods, all that destruction was also felt all the way here in this Reading home. Will the beach ever be that beautiful again? Will the beach ever be as pretty as I saw it? Will those shells be there for someone else to pick up? Just a little basket with a lot of shells and even more meaning. I've always loved these and now they're even more near and dear to my heart, so. It's been more than a decade since Lisa Carr has lived in Mexico Beach. That's the beach, baby. But no matter the years to her, it feels just like yesterday. It's just beautiful. You look out at that ocean, it's just endless. And you watch the dolphins follow the boats in and you try to take that in. She's heard the home she lived in does not exist anymore. No, I could sit out there at night and I'd hear the water come in. And other establishments are now rubble. Oh. I knew that the structures there could not take the blunt of this. She knew because just one year ago she was feeling the same worry, concern and pain. It's hard when these devastations come. When Hurricane Irma and Maria hit the U.S. Virgin Islands where Carr has family members. You can't get to them. I mean, how do you know your loved one's okay? You sit and wait. But sitting and waiting is not enough for her. I am devastated. So she stands up and looks forward to when she can head back to Mexico Beach. These mean so much to me because I can't be there. I wanted to be on the first plane out. And add shells to the collection she loves so much. You can shake the sand out of your boots, <laughs> but if you really are a, are a local, an islander, you know, you'll never get it out of your feet. Paula Soro, 9 on your side.